pee, you guys. It is six ish in the morning. Let's see what time it is. Six oh eight in the morning. I think I maybe got one solid hour of sleep. I had way really too much caffeine yesterday. It was really stupid, including having caffeine right before I went to bed. Within two hours of going to bed, I should say. <sighs> maybe it was stress and angst, worrying about this appointment today that we're going to go to. We're heading down to Children's Hospital to take our daughter Abby um, to go get an MRI. Jason has taken the day off today to be there for her. Um, he was supposed to work today, but our employee, she's wonderful, she's like, no, you go be with your family. Maybe your daughter's going to need you afterward. Maybe not. Maybe you just take a day off. Just go do it. So I'm, we're both allowed to go to the hospital for the appointment. COVID rules, if you're watching this in the future, but only one person is allowed to go back in the MRI room with her. Jason's letting me be that person. And I told him originally that at that point he could uh, just go to work. And he's like, no, I'll stay with her the whole time. That's, that's what you do as a parent. You just stay, go home with her, and she'll probably want a frozen lemonade at Chick-fil-A. It's right down the street. So we'll do whatever she wants. Um, she's pretty quiet about all this. She doesn't mind filming the process of it, but she won't talk about it. I don't think she ever will here on this channel, but she knows that you guys think of her and are wishing her the best. Hope we get some answers from this, depending on what the diagnosis is, you know, just kind of keep going forward. The reason why I was looking at the recliner chair the other day at Costco, if you watched that video, it's just a little blip in my day. I just happened to see the recliner at Costco and thought, hmm. That will be good if we get a certain diagnosis out of this MRI. So we might have to buy a recliner to help her recover, which is totally fine. So you do what you gotta do, you know? Either you buy a cast or you buy a recliner, <laughs> you know? You just have to like think of it in that way, you know? So we just want her to feel better. Let's head over to Children's Hospital and see what the doctors say. We won't get an answer today, maybe. Maybe the doctor will read the MRI and email us, but I doubt we'll get an answer today. We'll just take it as it comes. I'm driving, you're smiling, just really doing nothing. That's the thing I like about you. Mm. On the highway, it's our way, Route 66, and we keep on driving. We just do what we want to do, yeah. Nothing's complicated with you. Okay, she's all done. I went back with her, but I couldn't take my phone or my camera or couldn't even have anything metal with me. Um, it's really loud. <laughs> I had earplugs in myself. Uh, does it make like a banging sound or something? Yeah, it makes like there was like 10 different sounds. It was really strange. Are they a bunch of spinning magnets or something? Yeah, yeah. I guess so. Anyway, it makes me even more glad that I, we volunteer for Siemens and help with their ultrasound equipment because this oh, yeah. is the same company. Anyway, it's kind of cool. But she's changing and um, then we're done. It was really quick. I thought it was like a 45 minute scan, but it was only like 20 minutes, I think. But it's already, we left, got here. A little before 7 and it's 7 40 and we're done so i don't know we just have to wait for the results we're not doing a follow-up appointment we're just going to see what the doctor says and then if she wants us to come in we will but hopefully we can just communicate it um via uh the my chart app and then if she wants to see us we'll go in so i kind of want results i kind of want like something some kind of an answer yeah. i don't want nothing yeah, I want them to be like, oh, something. we see something here. This is how you fix yeah. it, even if it takes like a long time. We yeah. want answers. The unknown is the hardest thing. Yeah, yeah, and I don't anyway. Yeah. Okay. Jason and I ran and got Costco gas and did an Amazon return after dropping Abby out here at home. And I realized that Costco's not open yet beyond the gas, so I can't do my other return, and we need toilet paper. So. It's only 8.30, I think 8.35. Jason and I are gonna go back and get in bed. Because no one's awake. Oh, I'm going to bed. 
He's just going to the couch. Oh, I'm, sleep. I'm, go I'm going to the bed. <coughs> My bed. Oh, that felt good. Yeah, that nap felt good. But it's 11 o'clock. <laughs> to be fair, I woke up about a half hour ago. Oh, it's 11.20. Yeah. The thing is, I've only heard Chelsea awake. She came in here with an allergy attack and took a shower. I texted Jason a half hour ago and asked him if he was awake. I haven't heard back from him. <laughs> I think everyone's still asleep. I'm supposed to go to the lake today. And this clouds are supposed to burn off at around 1. So I'm kind of thinking, right now it looks miserable outside. But if we just get ready to go and get there right around 1, it'll be good timing. But I don't think... Jason wants to go, and I don't know if I want him to go. Because it's like girls' time at the beach. My girlfriends are going. <laughs> Sometimes when husbands go, it ruins the vibe. And Jason's not too sad about that, I don't think. I think he'd rather work outside today. Trim our trees and bushes, and hopefully he can rake and weed. So let's go see if that's what he's willing to do today. Okay, this one has a fever. Should we check it again? It's coming down. It was almost, it was 100 at one point. Okay, so you're just gonna stay home with dad, right? Yeah. Okay, Ash, where are we gonna go? The beach. Just me and you, kid. Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. So Ashley and I are gonna go to the beach by ourselves. Ash, can you get my phone for me? We packed a lunch. If anything, it's just the picnic at the lake. As you can see, it's not exactly beach weather, but the clouds are supposed to roll away here any minute. So we shall see. Meanwhile, we're gonna sneak up to the front and see what Jason's doing. So he's gonna slave and do all the hard work while I go sit at the beach. Yeah, things I do to make my wife's life easy. You did not want to go to the beach. You wanted to use an electric tree trimmer really, really bad. I'm correct. It needed to be done. It did. And the one bush. Oh, it looks like you haven't done these ones up here. I don't know what I'm going to do with those. I, don't know what's I think these ones all need to get torn out, and we need to come up with some other kind of box, box edge. Well, until we that was the only one that works. Okay, so I leave you to the yard work. Okay. Bye. Bye. You should go sit on sit sip on lemonade what? and and Cheetos. Make sure make sure you get a little selfie with your feet in front of the water out. I know, I will. I'll yeah, make sure I get that. Mandatory. You can get a selfie with you and the and the tree him hedge trimmer. Back in the car. We kind of had like sunny weather and then really cloudy weather and then really sunny like it is now and then cloudy. There's too many clouds left in the sky. Yeah, it felt nice like when the sun wasn't out in full glory. Because it was like super duper hot and then went down. And then yeah, so it kind of cooled you off. And then it just kept yeah. the perfect temperature. So like I would put my umbrella up when the sun came out and then I would put it down and the sun went away. But actually, some of the time I just wanted to get some color, so I left the umbrella down, down and then it just got too hot. But, but that was fun. Thank you for going with me, Boo. Mm -hmm. All the other moms were like, that's so cute. Just Ashley came. Um, and you get a slushie on our way home. It's sounding really good right now because it's nice and sunny and hot. Coming back to the car. I think my skin is like irritated more from my swimsuit. Can you see that? I don't think I'm actually sunburned. Maybe I got a little bit of color, but just irritated from my swimsuit. Oh, hang on. Okay, we aren't going on a date, but we are going to Costco. <laughs> just for fun, I've got to return some shorts that I got for Chelsea. They're actually back to school shorts. I think I showed them to you. Oh, the other day. Oh, it's Jacob and Kaylee. Hello. We're going back. We were at the park and then we went to Target. 
<laughs> just ran into Kaylee and Jacob and their friend Veronica. Um, came back from shopping. And their friends went to watch the sunset and were like, um, it doesn't start for like three hours. And they're like, yeah, I guess they wanted to get away from us. <laughs> anyway, we're gonna go to Costco. I've gotta get bigger size in these shorts because I need them for back to school. I need them to last like at least through the fall. Cause she'll wear shorts clear until it's snowing if she has her way. But they're just, they fit barely right now. So I need to change those. And then I think we're gonna get a new set of sheets if we can find some. What else, did you write it down? They're like oh, odd things. All we need is a, a nut. sheet and a nut. We broke uh, part of our little swing lawn chair at the fireworks. Well, the nut just came loose and it fell off, I guess. Yeah, so we lost the nut in the grass. And so, um, and then that was right when we were like leaving. It was like 11 p.m. and dark and couldn't find it. But we need that chair for tomorrow night because we're having game night, or not game night, we're gonna have adult beach night tomorrow night. It's not adults, I don't know how else to say it. I don't know, we're just gonna have friends. We're not like night. swingers down to the beach, I'm just saying. It's, it's just all going to hang fun. out, it's I mean, fun. I guess it, we could bring our kids, they have their kids down there. We could just. But they shove them off somewhere else. Well, we did that time because it was like the second of like it was the fourth of July thing. But no, kids aren't coming tomorrow night. So it's just the two of us going to hang out for the night. We just got home from Costco, got new sheets, and I got Chelsea's shorts, but I'm gonna tuck them away until she goes back to school. And then we came home to this is amazing. This is your last bit, Abby. Mm -hmm. She's been making these since before we left. Looks like I might need to try one of these guys. Mm-hmm. They're Oreo balls. Oreos, cream cheese, dipped in white chocolate. Wow. Very rich. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have fruit and some vegetables right now. I gotta get some dinner in me. And then we'll put the sheets on and I've got to edit. Kaylee, are you guys upstairs? Yeah. Okay. Also got the new pin to fix that little spot right there. But I think he's trying to find a smaller washer to make that kind of sit on there better. This is the base of my swing like beach chair. This is where my heart is, oh you know it's true No matter where I go, I'm coming home to you 